Two men have been convicted of plotting to blow up jet fuel tanks at New York's JFK airport. Federal prosecutors say they wanted to outdo 9-11 and called the plot the shining light. Prosecutors also say the men wanted to avenge perceived U.S. oppression of Muslims. It took a jury in Brooklyn five days to convict the men on multiple conspiracy charges. Russell DeFridis was a cargo handler at the airport. Abdul Qadir had been a member of Guyana's parliament. They were arrested in 2007 after an informant helped make tapes of conversations with the men. The government says the men wanted to kill thousands of people and cripple the American economy. They plotted to use explosives to blow up fuel tanks at the airport, as well as the underground pipelines that run through an adjacent Queens neighborhood. The government's case relied heavily on the tapes. They include DeFridis bragging about his knowledge of Kennedy Airport and its vulnerabilities. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.